Hello and welcome, you amazing person. My name is Rob. I'm the Manic Gaming Guy. Today is another tutorial for BMG map editors. As you guys enjoy these videos so much, hopefully you will enjoy this one. Today is a common issue that you tend to find is where's my map? Where has it gone? I cannot see it. After a while, you may see this little button down here called debug content. You click on that, you get a few more maps. And then you'll find your map and it's got its template preview. Replace this. And that's what we're going to be talking about today. Today we're going to be replacing this. And I'm also going to be stopping you having to do this. We're going to make it show up on this area. Stay tuned. First step, you're going to want to find your mod folder. So you open up your BMG whatever update you're up to click on mods and it's zipped we don't want it zipped let's unzip it so we go to beamng find the mods in the repository that you wish to unzip um i might be able to why have i got so many why have i got so many once you find it just click on it and you'll find unpack unpack your mod if your mod's already unpacked, you don't need to do this step, obviously. Ah, there we go. That was easy. Ah, yes. Now, when you click on the mods folder, you'll find it's not zipped. Go into unpacked folder, and you should find the one you're looking for. Remember, you're not looking for my folder. You're looking for your folder. And then you want to click on said folder. Navigate through the folder until you get to this folder. Um, no, you don't. Yeah, yeah. You want to find info. There we go. Brilliant. Once you're in this folder, you may want to change a few details. Like levels dot just go up. That's not right. Eventually, I'm not going to be calling this map just go up. But for now, I will stick to it for this video. Obviously, it's a bit cliche, the name. And I want it to be something different. Also, description. You may want to change this. To something else this will be popping up on the right hand side when you open bmg also this is wrong this should be 4096 because that's how big this map is um anyway the main important thing in here is you want to delete this line and then if all goes well you'll find um it will pop up on the main window rather than you having to push the debug button while you're here do feel free to change the features and suitable for and the roads and the biome and anything else that's recommended i forgot to say like i use plus plus c plus plus whatever no notepad plus plus you can probably just do this in notepad it wasn't really coding you're just changing some information so let's click on free room and let's see if it's there. And there we go. The map isn't now under debug. It's on the main window. But as you can see, we're still on the template preview. Replace this. So shall we replace it? I think we shall. Open back up your mod folder. And you want to be looking for underscore preview at the end and whatever your map name is. And you can just double click that and you'll find it'll open up the template preview to make sure you're right. And now what I recommend is you can right click and open with another program like say Photoshop or GIMP like I'm going to be using. So there you have it. There's the picture that we need to change. So let's change it. So for my picture, my plan is just to go into a little video I was making on the map that it's for. And I'm just going to take a picture in photo mode. I think that would do for the video. You can take much time as you want. And I think that's pretty, 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 pretty. Doesn't need to be a big picture. That's just only a thumbnail. Let's go locate my picture. It normally is the last one. 
and drag it over to GIMP and resize it and all that. Now, when you're happy with something you've got, obviously I've been rushing this, take your time, make something pretty and nice catching. You just simply replace the file. Um, as for file size, I'm not too sure. You'll have to experiment. But I'm going to override this one. Export. Happy days. Now when I go into BeamNG, go into Map, the picture's been changed. So you've now learnt how to take out a debug and change the default picture, as well as change some of the description and whatever else you need to change. Now your map is looking a bit more professional. Thank you for stopping by. I've been the Madden Gaming Guy. You've been an amazing person as always. If you've really enjoyed this video, feel free to hit like and subscribe. Uh, I do recommend, if this is your first time popping over to one of mine, uh, go find some other videos. I've made a lot of tutorials that are doing really well at the moment with Beam and G editing. I also like to have a bit of fun on the side while racing around like a lunatic in the maps that I'm making, the cars that I'm making, automation, the car company construction game. You will also find me in No Hesse, I said, of course, uh, and uh, dabbling in a little bit of city building and things like that. So if you enjoyed this personality, feel free to stick around. Hopefully I'll catch you in the next one. Keep it real, stay safe, and share that love. Bye-bye now.